everyone, it's Moonlight Mason. Welcome back to my channel. I want to talk a little bit about Shane Dawson and Jeffree Star and this whole new series that Shane has going on, which I think is very interesting, actually. So that's what this video is going to be about. So if you're... If, if you want to watch what I have to say, just keep watching all right <laughs> perspective on life and uh, one thing's for sure I'm not going to be repetitive on what other videos uh, you're not going to hear the same thing from me that you hear from other videos from other youtubers that are out there I want to keep it interesting and I want to keep it different and so in this video I want to talk about Shane Dawson and um, Jeffree Star so just a little bit about Jeffree Star. I've loved Jeffree Star. I've watched Jeffree Star for a very long time. I used to be really into, and I kind of miss it to be honest. Um, I used to be really into makeup videos every morning when I put my makeup on. Um, yeah, I've always liked Jeffree Star and uh, I just have this thought in my head that I'm going to share with you and get it out of the way because it's just really funny. Um, and it's just funny. I have always liked men that are androgynous. So my whole life, I've been attracted to men. I love men. I Even in a friendship basis, I would rather hang up with the hang up. I would rather hang up on a guy. No, I'd rather hang out with, with men than women. I just uh, find that men and I get along a lot easier. A lot of women, I, I don't really have any women friends that have the same interests that I have. So I, I just seem to get along better with males. So the Jeffrey is a man dressed in women's clothing, which I absolutely love. But what I want to tell you is a couple of videos ago, he, I think he was coming out of his car. He was walking from somewhere and he was wearing, you know, like this really cool, like jumpsuit or, you know, I don't know, but you got, you know, and I never had seen this before. So it just really like, kind of like just tripped me up is what it did. But it kind of showed the outline of his penis, like just for a little bit. You saw a penis there when he was walking. <laughs> I mean, of course, he does have one and he talks about it quite frequently. But I had never really seen it so outlined in one of his outfit outfits. And so um, I never thought that he would tuck it back. I, I don't think that is something that he would do because, you know, he says he's a man, but he likes to dress you know, dress and, and, you know, he's gay. And uh, anyways, it's just uh, something I wanted to share with you because I thought it was just uh, humorous. That's all. I saw the outline of Jeffree Star's penis. Okay, so let's get into this video with Shane. Um, one of the things that I want to comment that was making me uncomfortable, okay? One of the things about the video that was making me uncomfortable, and I'm sure they've talked about it and it's okay, it was just so much about um, how much money he has, you know, and how much did this cost? And I get it, you know, I get it. We're all interested in that and I absolutely, I love that. I mean, if you know me as a friend, you know, I always will ask and someone can ask me, you know, and or I'll volunteer the information. I really don't see anything wrong with that. But it was just a bit too much to where, you know, maybe the video was just obviously edited that way, you know. But um, it was just so much of, well, you know, how much is in this room? And I love that closet with the, you know, secret, you know, code to get in. What's really funny is I made a video maybe over a year ago, on how Shane was telling Trisha that he doesn't take showers that often. And, and him wearing that shirt, 
You know, I keep looking at that shirt and I keep saying, okay, he, I, I hope he has like, you know, 30 of those. Like, I hope every day he puts on a clean one and he has like 50 of those shirts. I hope it's not the same one. And uh, I do hope that he is taking more showers now. I don't know. Being uh, hygienically clean is very important to me, but I just want to throw this in there. Jason Nash has replaced <laughs> Shane Dawson in the no shower department because Jason was there with Jeffrey and the thing with the shoes, I mean, I almost felt like vomiting when they smelled his shoes and I was like, you know, and the, the, the thing where I understand about losing the socks. I do understand that. I don't understand. I will never understand. I won't ever understand not having enough time to take a shower because it's your butthole and it's the crevices that need to be washed. Your feet, your underarms, you know, these are the things that you need to focus on. Man or woman, you need to keep yourself hygienically clean. And Jason Nash, for some reason right now in his life, I don't know if he's always been this way. I, I don't know if it's a new thing. I do know that it's some past unresolved issue, obviously, because most of us, most of us do shower every day. And it's not something to boast about, it's just the way it is. This is something that as a human being, you need to be doing. You need to shower every single day. Sometimes I take two showers, but when he was still at Trisha's house and he was talking about his feet and how he felt a little, you know, weird about it, all that talking, all that talking took the same amount of time as it would have for him to sit on Trisha's bathtub on the edge and just open the water and just wash his feet if that was his main concern and find some socks and you know, and then when Jeffrey gave Jason those new shoes, oh Lord, and he went and he put these stinky ass feet of his. I don't know what's happening with the toes, between the toes. I don't know, but he put that in the new shoes, the new expensive designer shoes. I just about lost it. I was like, oh my God, you're not going to put those on. And he did. And so I'm just like, oh my God, I wonder if it's going to make them smell. And I don't know. I, I just, I don't know. Did you guys think of that? Did you not? I'm just a very clean person and I really appreciate hygiene. And uh, there's just a lot about Jeffrey that that I like. I, I the, the thing that I love the most about Jeffrey Star is how he can be unapologetically him. He can just show up and be himself. And I am really interested in knowing how he became so wealthy. I think it's wonderful. I didn't know he had three assistants, which I really liked when one of them brought them each a drink. The next, I think there's going to be 10. Is that correct? There's going to be 10 videos that Shane is doing where I don't know where I got that from 10. But it's exciting. I think it's really going to propel Shane Dotson to another level. Him doing this kind of, um, you know, series like he did with um, Tiana. I just have a feeling that this is going to be so much better. Especially since it's Jeffree Star who kind of like rules. Like Jeffree Star rules, you know. And it's interesting because when I meet people in my everyday life, the people who know me in my everyday life, that do not work at Sephora. Nobody knows anyone that I talk about. So I have a lot of friends on Facebook and they have no idea when these videos come up. They're like, you know, they have zero idea and zero interest in who I'm talking about. And when I sometimes explain it like to my sister or I'll explain it to a friend or, you know, one of my clients on how big some of these YouTubers are, they're, they're kind of fascinated in a way. I know that there's a lot of um, doubt on how much money they make, but uh, they're just, they just don't know. So when I come on camera and I talk to you guys, I am literally like talking to a friend because you guys are the only ones I can talk to about these YouTubers like Jeffree Star and Shane and, and Trisha and I want to talk about Trisha too but not in this one 
So anyways, that's it. I just really look forward to seeing more videos on Jeffree Star. I know number two went up today. I have not watched it. I have been so busy. I need more hours in the day. Anyways, that's all I have to say about Jeffree Star and Shane Dawson. And I look forward to the rest of Shane's videos with Jeffree. I will talk to you guys later in my next video. Bye.